Hello guys, welcome to the Ashley Lancelot Show. Today is going to be the update rambling video. I've been doing for the past week. Um, but if you like this video, please subscribe, hit the like button as well. Uh, we've been up to slowly gain subs, and that's pretty good. Ash has been doing most of the live stream. I actually played Shadow of Colossus. I played on the PS2. I also have the remake of, the, of it of the PS3, but I never really touched the PS3. Um, I only beat two bosses in the PS2. I only but Ash went to the third boss and beat it. I got a couple more bosses I'm gonna play over this weekend. Uh, Ash has been playing the live streaming the new Bayonetta, actually remake of the Bayonetta. We had this on the X, the first one, the Xbox 360. Then we have the Wii U, uh, the Wii U version of it comes one and two. We got a Switch version as well. So she is live streaming number one, and uh, she, after she beats Ash, we'll play number two. She never did play two. I did, but I never played one. So, um, that's kind of interesting, <laughs> uh, playing something new than not going, correlating with the story and so forth. Uh, I've been doing okay. I've been off and on, uh, to your truth within a week or two, uh, due to that I'm, for some reason, getting sick again, uh, went to the doctors and, um, having a hard time getting out of bed, uh, to tell you the truth. <laughs> have a hard time getting in bed, hard time getting to sleep as well. My body just literally just crashed off and on throughout the day. I had to literally skip a couple classes and just basically relax, relax in the back of the car while my mom's in her class. So yeah, it's been, eh, it, 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 it's like going up and down. I, probably because of the move. Uh, we're going to post some uh, move videos. Uh, right now I have people that's posing as me on Facebook scamming for money and stuff like that. I actually have pics of it, but um, it's really weird because this early morning, I believe it was like six or seven in the morning, uh, my best friend um, texted me. It's like, someone's posing as you. I'm like, huh, on Facebook. It's like, okay. I thought someone like hacked my account. So I checked. My account's fine. Nothing been said on anything. And I asked, you know, then I had a friend that that's uh, it was in the army and he got out and he's back in the Middle East as a contractor over there. And, um, and Af I believe he's in the Middle East, I think he's Afghanistan or somewhat. Uh, but, um, sent me a picture. I looked at him like, huh, he has my first name. And it's like asking for government money and stuff like that. I'm like, hmm, that's very weird. I'm actually going to post it. And um, so far, this guy has my first name. I mean, this was early in the morning. Hello. Um, has anyone contacted you from the U.S. Direct Relief Fund? Funding program by the state and FUD government workers' compensation appeal board. No, why? They are helping the working class people, old and retired citizen workers with fund. Wonder if you do you got your money yet? Because I saw your name among the receiver list. You got yours too. I saw your name among the mission, uh, beneficiary's name, and when they came to my house, I think you need to contact the agent in the charge to receive yours. So I'm like, hmm, that is a scam. And I, and I, I got some more videos, uh, more uh, pics of it as well. And I got some more, I got more pics, but you know, same thing, you know, same. Nope, how is your retirement going? Because everyone knows that I'm out of the military. I am. And this I, mean, I get my pension check from the disability from the VA. How uh, what happened to your phone? I'll turn it to your picture. So picture is one key. Even though see they even change their name to Lancelot Lyles. My full name said Lancelot. Now it's Lancelot Lyles. At one time they just screw up when they sent. And look, good thing I actually contacted all my family and Facebook friends. I posted shit out of it. Like, you know, uh share this i was doing on my youtube page as well as like someone's going out for government money stuff like that it's a scam you know has no pictures so far or there's pictures of me in it but uh so far you know you, you know, if you go use my full name to tell you the truth i i have the most horrible half of grammar and this is like perfect grammar and a lot of my friends that knows me you know he's like that's not lance <laughs> he gotta be too drunk to actually type this perfectly or and it's someone else and uh so yeah so until they uh texted my cousin like i i'm not gonna put my cousin's name out 
Uh, so this is what, hello, how, how's it going, man? How, has anyone contacted you from the US Direct? I think so, why? So basically, uh, I think they looked at my Air Force background on my profile page that I'm retired and used that to scam people. But, you know, a lot of people that I make friends with and know people uh, are smart enough to know it's a scam. Picture, name, and how I talk to people usually. Uh, I, you know, buying, usually my Facebook is usually active because I'm always usually on the phone and Facebook most of the time. But I got a lot of people like, are you okay, Lance? Stuff like that. I'm like, yeah, I'm fine. And I'm like, oh, it's like, oh shit. You know, yeah. Someone's posing as me. So my account wasn't hacked. Someone just made a duplicate account to be like me, but not me. <laughs> it was a very weird Sunday. And uh, yeah, I, I thank my uh, I thank my friend for letting me know about that. So uh, I, your true friends, you know, will let you know. Um, but I'm happy my account wasn't hacked because it's like a 21 encrypt like those random key gen shit that I, I do with all, most of all my passwords. So it's so harder for any uh, coders to do it. You can break it. It'll take a long time to do it. But went to the doctors. Um, going to go to court in a couple months to see the judge for the social security then go to the actual court moving in mid of june but if you guys want to help donate for the move the link will be down below for the gofundme uh also you guys can share it as well um but yeah the move is like probably the, the main thing that's probably uh making me sick tired today i just went out with my mom and uh bought hundred dollars worth of uh totes and uh, bubble wraps and tape that we can finish up the one section of the living room i'm gonna post a video up for that for my all the games i have on that like newer games that we usually play and finish that side all the animes and packed up as well um we are going to be slowly taking down probably next month taking down half of our our stuff in the office packed up ready to go uh, most of my wife is pretty much going to do it. My wife is basically the ones packing the stuff because I cannot lift any five pounds because I'll break my back. I had a severe chest pain just moving freaking DVDs and games around, packing and rearranging it myself. And my whole half of my body is like freaking in pain for some reason. Uh, probably because, you know, I haven't been working out as much as I used to, but um, I could lift very heavy stuff. I really wanted to, but my back would just give in. So, like, sucks hopefully when you get a new place find a new place i get a gym uh find a gym that's indoor pool because the physical therapy cannot do anything i just tried everything and they want me to do water exercise indoor water exercise with at least the water's warm and work out my muscles there hopefully you know gradually be a lot better but it doesn't seem hopeful at all i'm gonna try to see a neurologist i'm like we already been through this path, you know, they can't do anything with a nerve ending. Uh, they go, all you do is cut the nerves, but a lot of these doctors don't want to cut my nerve and and uh, stop the pain. But the problem is that I won't, if I don't feel pain, you know, um, more damage can be done to it, like me pumping it up, I won't notice it. But you know, that, it is how it is. Uh, life is pretty much, you know, crap. <laughs> But anyhow, but I thank you guys for the support and everything else. Thank you guys for joining the stream. Um, I'm probably going to take more, a couple more days uh, of me not streaming, probably once or twice this week, like I did uh, this following week. And I'm going to try to get better. Uh, I'm getting coming down with a cold. It's been a cold front over here for the past week. And it's been raining a lot, especially where we live. It's going to rain this whole week. And uh, hopefully by the end of March, it'll be one way spring break from school. I'll do a uh, stream a thon with me and my wife. Uh, one of my very good friends, and my other best friend, that's from San Diego, is coming up here for his convention in Rockville. So tomorrow I'll be probably, uh, um, well, probably Wednesday, I will have whiskeys in her hand. You have any uh, psych psychological or a or a psychiatrist type of question let me know i'll ask my friend al al is try to be a child development psychology basically a school counselor um um but you know 
He's getting his graduate degree in San Diego State. He's a very good guy. He's a very good friend of mine. We've been through a lot of shit since elementary fourth grade. Yeah, I actually have friends from preschool that I slowly talk to, but not much anymore. Uh, I don't know what two ones doing. I should give him a call. I saw this number. But yeah, it's been one of those days. You know, it's been off and on. My brain is slowly remembering, but the problem with that is now my brain is just, if I retain it for a couple hours, in the next couple minutes, I just brain dump everything. So I'm happy in school, I have all my notes, I try to remember flashcard, but it's not really working. It's just that my brain just like telling me to stop. I need a break. I've been doing this for over two years straight. Getting all these good grades. Now I'm, I'm getting now I'm failing classes due to me not just not taking a break. So after I move, I'm gonna take a break from school, take a semester or two to hope I refresh myself and go to my doctor's appointment. Like I should be going, but I can't because you know I have school and I have to get paid, get paid get the money to pay the rent it sucks no responsibility stuff you know it's like all this program it's like you gotta literally fight for and get a lawyer for it it's like holy shit been like a really big headache uh for me but you know don't give up for the people that are also dealing with this always think positive keep moving forward no matter what you know that Someone's going to have a worse state than you. So far that I'm just like dealing with this, like, hmm. And I got to fight with Social Security. I was like, hmm. Now the, what else am I going to fight for? VA, get my, uh, get my surgery here or in Korea. Because if not, you know, I may get surgery within a year or two from here. I might have seen my go to Korea yes. and do it. Yes, honey. Yeah. So it's been uh, interesting. Yeah, my wife checks up on me because she's a caregiver. Getting paid to take care of me. Usually all that money goes through groceries and shit. But yeah, uh, but yeah. Let me know what you guys think of this piece of wasn't posing as me. Yeah, it's been very interesting. It's been very interesting. But anyhow, guys, I'll talk to you guys uh later and I hope you guys have a great day and a great week.